Welcome, I'm Dr. Janine Barry, naturopathic doctor, and today I'm talking about iodine deficiency with nine tips to improve your iodine deficiency. So stay tuned right until tip number nine, which you will love and probably something that you haven't heard before. Okay, tip number one is to eat more seafood. So if you're not a vegetarian, this is definitely the best way to get your iodine in an absorbable form that personally I believe is delicious, but also making sure that you're getting those cofactors for that thyroid function as well in seafood, which is naturally occurring. So things like DHA, sometimes some vitamin D, also some magnesium, some zinc. This is really important for making sure that all of these minerals are working in conjunction with one another and doing it in a natural way and helping to improve that thyroid function. Tip number two is to get more sunlight. So yes, I, it's very rare for me to talk about tips without talking about the hidden benefits of the sun and getting natural sunlight exposure on our skin. This is what helps along with iodine, along with DHA from our seafood to help to turn that sunlight energy into electrical chemical signaling in our body to run our internal battery to make sure our mitochondria are working as they should to produce that energy it's really important that we're getting enough sunlight and doing that regularly tip number three is to decrease our EMF exposure yes so iodine is somewhat protective against that EMF radiation that we get from all of our devices and things that are plugged in around us from that you know Wi-Fi and our cell phones and all of these things I have an entire other video all about EMFs and how to decrease our EMF exposure, so make sure you check that out. That's really, really important, but this is why, you know, often we can run into iodine deficiencies is because iodine is working to help to protect us. Tip number four is to get enough sleep. So definitely our thyroid gland is most active when we're sleeping, and if we're lacking in iodine, if our thyroid function is not optimized, this goes hand in hand with the iodine deficiency and the other minerals as well for helping to regulate our circadian rhythms and our proper sleep cycle. So making sure that you get a restful night's sleep is really, really important for your overall health, but for that iodine and the thyroid as well. Tip number five is to eliminate fluoride. So we know that fluoride will trap up our iodine and fluoride we get from often toothpaste. It can be in fluoridated water from fluoride treatments at the dentist as well. So you want to do everything in your power to decrease any type of exposure to fluoride. Make sure it's not in the water that you are drinking and do whatever you can to protect yourself from fluoride because that will rapidly deplete your iodine levels. Tip number six is to use whole food sources for iodine. So if you do need to supplement, one of my favorite whole food sources is kelp, which is naturally, of course, occurring iodine from the ocean. And this really helps to support thyroid health as well. So we'll put a link below to a great thyroid support supplement that helps with low thyroid function to help to get that metabolism going and to help to make sure that you're getting enough of that thyroid that is properly absorbed from that whole food kelp source. Tip number seven is to really pay attention to the type of salt that you're using in your cooking, in your diet. Make sure that there is some naturally occurring iodine within that salt. And sometimes the iodine needs to be added back into a sea salt. And if you're using table salt, this is something to pay attention to. Table salt isn't my favorite source of, you know, salt, but I use a mixture of salts just to make sure that I'm covering up for that th potential iodine deficiency. So I use Celtic salt, I use Himalayan, I use sea salt, and I also use a little bit of regular table salt, but not that often. Tip number eight is to make sure that you're getting enough selenium. So selenium is important. It also helps with making sure that our iodine status is where it should be. One of the best sources of natural selenium is Brazil nuts. So by eating two to three Brazil nuts per day, it's a great way to get in enough selenium, which again works hand in hand with your your iodine, very important for your thyroid function as well, and your metabolism.
And tip number nine is to do a regular full body detox. You want to make sure that you are eliminating especially heavy metal toxins from your body. So things like mercury, things like aluminum, these are often accumulated in, in our organs, in our brain, in our bodies. So unless we're doing something, you know, proactively to eliminate these toxins from our bodies and doing a full body detox at least three to four times a year with specific herbal medicine that's something that I definitely recommend to get those toxins out. We know that the heavy metals can definitely lead to an iodine deficiency because iodine is one of those things along with magnesium and other minerals that helps to protect us from those toxins. So by making sure that we're getting and eliminating those toxins and the heavy metals in a natural and healthy way, it's something that we can really do to help to bolster up our thyroid function because now our iodine won't have to be as depleted because it's trying to protect us from those heavy metals. So something to think about and something that maybe is new that you haven't heard before. I would love to hear from you in the comment section below if you do have questions about what I talked about today or you have just some comments. I always love to interact and to hear what you're thinking. Also be sure to share this video with someone that you know who will benefit with these tips about iodine and of course thyroid function as well. Please give me a big thumbs up. I truly appreciate all your great feedback and if you're new to my channel welcome in. I hope that you'll subscribe. Also turn on those post notifications by clicking that bell so you're always notified of my newest and latest uploads, which happens every single day of the week. And remember to always take good care of your health and do it naturally. Thanks for watching today.